All right, so now that we have our lock installed, we our smart lock installed, we have the ability to use a key to lock and unlock the door. We also have the ability to use the touchpad uh, in order to do this. Now, here's our security feature. Keeps anybody from reading your fingerprints. Lock and unlock the door just like that. Uh, now, in order to access this lock from anywhere in the world, to be able to lock and unlock it when we're not at home, uh, for anybody, we'll have to set up the Delaney hub. Okay, so now that we have our smart lock installed, now we have to set up the hub. The hub is a great thing because it's a camera and it controls any other Z-Wave device that's in your home. It's really great because Z-Wave runs on a different frequency from your home Wi-Fi, which means you don't get any, inter any type of interference from uh, your Wi-Fi network. Uh, also, on top of that, Z-Wave uses the same type of encryption that banks use when they transmit your data over the internet. So it's super high security. So now what we need to do is go ahead and plug this in, download the app, and get to work on that. All right, now that we've gone ahead and we've plugged in the hub, uh, let's talk a little bit about what it actually does. So the hub is the brain for your entire smart home. It basically talks to your phone uh, through the app, and you talk back to it. And then what happens is it transmits data from different devices and back to you, and you can transmit through the hub to those devices so that you can have con complete control over your smart home. All right, so now that we have the hub up, the smart lock installed, what we're gonna have to do is go in and download the Delaney app. So we'll go into our Play Store, or if you have an Apple, you can go into the Apple uh, Store. And then we're gonna go in here and we're gonna search for the Delaney Z-Wave. What that brings up is this really nice looking logo right here. We'll click right here. And normally you'd have to download it and install it. I've already gone ahead and done that for us so that we didn't have to wait on it. Then what we'll do is go in, open up, this is what you see. And now we're ready to add that hub. All right, so now that we have our smart lock installed, we have our camera hub set up. What we're gonna do is add the camera hub to the app. So we'll press right here. We'll go to set up a new gateway. Uh, there's a fixed camera gateway that we need to go to. Looks exactly like the hub that we have. We're gonna tell it that we wanna install through the Wi-Fi. Now, it'll tell us that we have to be on a 2.4 gigahertz uh, Wi-Fi network, which is pretty standard for everybody. Then we'll go in here. It tells us to make sure that we do not connect the Ethernet cable, but we do plug it in. Now we're going to go in here, and we're going to add our Wi-Fi password. All right, now that we've put in our Wi-Fi password, we go to the next step. It tells us that we need to press this little button on the side of our gateway. So we push that button, and as you can see, there's several different lights flashing. That means we're ready to go. So we'll hit continue. It says after clicking continue, it'll show you the QR code. So this is imperative for getting it installed. We have a QR code here. That means that it has accepted the programming. So now what it's doing is it's connecting to our Wi-Fi signal so that we'll be able to access this hub from anywhere. 